Like a Dragon Gaiden, the man who raised his name has been a blast to play, especially since Secret Agent Joryu is a breath of fresh air for the franchise, giving us these awesome moves, two of which are absolutely broken. Of course, this new version of Kiryu would not be possible if it were not for the Daidoji faction and its loyal agent manager Kihei Hanawa. But who knew that this accountant-looking agent would turn out to be the most interesting revelation in Like a Dragon Gaiden? So who exactly is Hanawa? But before that though, please hit the like and subscribe button if you like using Serpent to mow down on your enemies. Join Otaku Define for more Yakuza content. Well, let's get straight to the point here. Kihei Hanawa's true identity is none other than Yu Morinaga, an antagonist in Yakuza 5 who served as a bodyguard for Daigo. Obviously, this is not just a guess, where I flip a coin and decided who was Hanawa between Aizawa and Morinaga. There's evidence that points out that Hanawa's true identity is Morinaga. One indication is that Hanawa and Morinaga have the same voice actor, being Hiroki Tochi. However, this alone isn't conclusive evidence, as we also have Kasuhiro Nakaya, who boys characters like Nishikiyama and Ichiban. Thankfully, Hanawa left a lot of trails to point out who exactly he is. It's like the dude is begging to be found out by Kiryu. Another proof that Hanawa is Morinaga is his strong negative view of the Tojo clan and its history of betrayal. With Nishiki betraying Kiryu, Tarada betraying the whole Tojo clan, there's even a whole chapter in Yakuza 4 titled Chain of Betrayals. It's kinda like the whole theme of the Yakuza game series and Yakuza 5 focused greatly on that theme. The betrayal that happened between Morinaga and his sworn brother Aizawa. That's why Hanawa knows a lot about betrayals in the Tojo clan. He both did it and went through it himself. Another reason is by the end of Like a Dragon Gaiden, and this is actually the biggest clue. At the end of Like a Dragon Gaiden, Hanawa gives Kiryu his new passport and credit card under a new alias, erasing his codename as Joryu. Kiryu was then surprised to see that his new passport is named after his old alias as Taichi Suzuki, to which Hanawa reveals that he knows Kiryu has used the Suzuki alias before, which leads us to believe that Kiryu met Hanawa back in December 2012 during the events of Yakuza 5. So narrowing it down, Hanawa is most certainly Morinaga. The last proof is Hanawa's faith in Kiryu's principles. When Hanawa got kidnapped, he told Kiryu to choose the most important thing. When Hanawa got rescued by Kiryu, he jokingly told Kiryu what took you so long. Hanawa clearly knows how Kiryu acts as a person. And Kiryu is a man who strongly believes in his principles and is willing to do whatever it takes to ensure that they are upheld. The biggest point that led us to believe that Hanawa has faith in Kiryu is when Hanawa used the Sunflower Orphanage to convince Kiryu. Hanawa believes that Kiryu is willing to do anything for the sake of the kids. This belief stems from Hanawa witnessing Kiryu's actions in Yakuza 5 where Kiryu, hiding under the alias of Suzuki, went to great lengths to protect Haruka's career as an idol. So Hanawa is clearly Morinaga from Yakuza 5. But of course, there are a lot of counterpoints to this theory. One of which is Hanawa's fighting style. By the end of chapter 2, we fight against Hanawa who uses a fighting style similar to Detective Kisuke Watanabe from Lost Judgment, which is absurdly different from Morinaga's rush jab cross and hook combo. But it's not unusual for Yakuza characters to change or evolve their fighting styles, with Kiryu using agent style and even Yagami learning boxing in Lost Judgment. Another argument is that Morinaga died in the events of Yakuza 5, but Morinaga's death was never shown and a lot of presumed dead characters turned out to be alive anyways. Like Kashiwagi chilling in Survive, Anderson drumming in And maybe at some point Ryuji too, since RGG is really teasing us at this point. The final argument is that Morinaga doesn't resemble Hanawa. But if a character like Mirror Face can exist, then getting a basic face surgery shouldn't be a big deal. We know that Morinaga went into hiding after the events of Yakuza 5, and by 2018, he found himself working as a manager agent for the Dai Doji faction. So we can confidently say that Hanawa is Morinaga. But I'm interested in hearing your thoughts. Do you think Hanawa is Morinaga, or maybe is actually Ryuji? Share your opinions in the comments below. Like a Dragon Gaiden is so fun to play that I finished it immediately and now I'm playing the demo for Infinite Wealth. Speaking of which, here are the things that I find exciting for Like a Dragon 8. Click this video right here. Join Otaku Define for my Yakuza content. This is Math, and stay awesome, my dudes.